Hey guys, Kermit right here. I will be playing. Uh, okay, wait. Actually, I'm not really gonna be playing anything. Actually, I'm just gonna be uh, talking about some recent news with uh, Roblox car related games. Uh, I'm sure, as you guys know by the title and thumbnail, you guys know exactly what this is about. But this is my first video uh, over this topic in general. But I feel like this is enough information and stuff that I've gathered to actually make a video about this and tell you guys what the heck is going on and uh, everything that's been happening. So. Uh, yeah, but before we get started, if you guys do not mind hitting that subscribe button on the good old channel, I'm trying to hit 300k by the end of this year. Uh, and we are super close. We're at 283, uh, 283,000 right now by the time I'm recording this video. So we are getting very, very close. So if you guys are trying to subscribe to the channel, that would be much, much appreciated. And like the video as well as so you start with con, dude. You guys already know. But without further ado, let's just get straight into this video. So as you guys know, just over the course of playing Roblox, you guys would know that car brands are just disappearing and going out of Roblox. Some can get completely just gone out of Roblox, and most of them just getting off sale, which sucks a lot. And I have a whole list of cars that I'm going to be telling you guys uh, about what's going on and why they're leaving. But uh, so basically, to my understanding, I, I don't have a full 100% grasp on this, but to my understanding, I think car companies do not like their cars being in the game, obviously, because as you guys have noticed, they have like fake names. So I'm going to go in here. And uh, show you guys what we got. I'll show you an example. I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about. But these cars got like fake examples, like the Mazda Miata is a Mazuku Laguna. So it's not actually a Mazda Miata because uh, unfortunately, Rolex does not have car licenses, uh, which kind of sucks. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hey, yo, Carter. Add me on Discord. Add me on Discord. Add me on Discord. Add me on Discord. Meow. 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 All right, anyways, I lost my. Uh... Where was I going with that? I Where was I going with that? Anyways, but yeah, cars have fake brand names because they obviously, Roblox does not have car licenses, so they are not allowed to uh, have cars in the game. So they make fake logos and fake names, hoping to bypass the copyright um, so cars don't get copyrighted. But as you guys would know, it is still happening because I think the cars, I want to say it's just because the cars, their, their, their models are spot on. I mean, it's literally, I hate to be doing this, but the cars are literally spot on. The models are basically spot on. The logos are just different. As you guys can see, this is a new S650 Mustang. Literally spot on. No no different changes or anything like that at all. My fault to change time. But as you guys know, companies do not like that, so they're going to copyright you. They're going to copyright the games and force the creators to take the cars off of the game. Now, that is whether you can purchase them still or not. So, I have a list of all of the cars that have been... Uh, off sale and deleted from the game here. So this is a big long list and actually the time recording this video There's actually some new recent ones. So I'm pretty the first car brand to ever leave Roblox uh, Totally was Lamborghini Lamborghini was the first one uh, And then I it just started spiraling and snowballing after that I don't know exactly what car brand went after that But uh, yeah right now the current off sale cars that you can still have in the game that if you have them in your inventory And you had them before uh, you still have them, but you just cannot buy them uh, it is Genesis, Audi, Lucid, Kia, Maserati, Bentley, Hyundai, GMC, Buick, Chevrolet, Cadillac, Saturn, Pontiac, Saab, Oldsmobile, Hummer, Holden, BMW, Rolls-Royce, Mini, Lotus, Koenigsegg, Suzuki, and uh, some of the Hennessy Chevys are off sale too in Greenville. But that only is to Greenville. So that is all the cars that are off sale uh, that are no longer in the dealership. So if I were to go in here, um, I'll show you guys. I'll search up like Auto Work, which is Audi. There's nothing. No cars found. You cannot buy Audis anymore, unfortunately. Uh, but the most recent cars to go is GM. So that's GMC, Chevy, Cadillac, Saturn, Pontiac. Um, all of those GM brands, which I never thought GM would go. But here we are. It just seems like every single week or month, there's at least one car brand uh, going. Uh, also, car brands that are totally gone from the game. Just deleted in general. Like, you can't even have them in your inventory if you had them. Toyota, Lexus, Scion, Lamborghini, and Bugatti. Those are all gone. You can't even have those in your inventory. You can't even, you cannot buy them also. I'm not too sure what the, I don't know why some cars are able to stay in the game, but you can't buy them, but some cars just get totally deleted. I think it's the way that the uh, manufacturers contact Roblox or contact the games and say, delete my cars. They can either say, just make my cars unobtainable, uh, which means you can't buy them. So they just take them off sale, but you can still have them if you've bought them. Or they just say, take it out from the game entirely. Uh, and I think that's what happened to Toyota, Lexus, Scion, Lamborghini, and Bugatti. Uh, but thankfully, we still have actually a lot of uh, cars that are just off sale. And it sucks you can't purchase them, but it's really good that we still have them in the game. Uh, like, BMW is probably one of the best ones that we uh, still have. I'm really glad we have BMW still. Um, but the most recent car to go was uh, GM, like I said. GMC, Buick, Cadillac, Chevy, uh, Saturn, Pontiac. All of those cars are gone. They literally went off sale today as I was filming this. Yeah, I think so. Hey! hey! 
What? Hey. Buy all GM products right now. What happened? Is GM going away too? Yeah, yeah, all right, yeah. I'm buying every Chevrolet I can get. Bro! What? Yeah, and Southwest Florida, we had one last car meet with a bunch of GM vehicles before we just see them vanish. Uh, because uh, I've heard some things, and I think GM might just be completely going as well. Uh, manufacturers or uh, Roblox games were told to just take the game's cars off sale in the game. Uh, but I think from stuff I've seen, I think GM might be just completely out of the game. Not too sure yet. Don't take my word for that, but we will just see as the time comes. But, uh, yeah, boys. So there's none of that in Greenville. I'm gonna hop over to Southwest Florida. Uh, you know, just for a change of scenery and show you guys, uh, what we got going on in there too. All right, but here we are now in Southwest Florida. And as you guys can see, I did. I just went through and bought a bunch of the GM cars before they went off sale. Uh, because I was in the game when they got news that GM was going off sale. So thankfully, I was able to buy a couple. <laughs> you are not able to buy any more GM cars in the dealership here. So I'm going to head over here um, and show you guys. There's no more GM cars, unfortunately. All gone. Look at that. No GM cars. There's mostly in trucks. No GMC. None of that. Look at that. That sucks, dude. No GM cars. I never thought GM would go, but... I mean, look at this. We still have a good amount of cars we can still pick from. Which I'm not complaining, but I feel like that list is gonna go... Yo, I thought Audi was off sale. Um, you, uh, uh, yeah, I just slipped that by. It doesn't matter. Alright, yeah, but as you guys can see, there's no Toyota or Lexus or anything like that, which kind of sucks. That's probably one of my favorite car brands. Toyota and Lexus. Top tier car brand right there. But uh, yeah, also I got news. I think, I think Alfa Romeo was removed from Driving Empire. Um... And if you guys know, Alfa Romeo is also owned by, uh, it starts with an S, the car group starts with an S, Stellantis, Stellantis, they own a bunch of different cars, so that is uh, like Fiat, Dodge, Maserati, Chrysler, Jeep, uh, they own all of that, and if Alfa Romeo is gone out of Driving Empire, then that means soon to come after that, I'm guessing would be Dodge, Maserati, and all of that. So I am not too sure, but that'd be my next speculation on car brand that is going to go. Uh, but yeah, dude, this really sucks. It's really sad to see all of these car brands leaving Roblox. Um, but it is 100% Roblox's fault. It is not the game, by the way, because I know a lot of you guys think it's the game. It is not the game's fault. It is Roblox themselves because they don't have car licenses. I mean, I guess it is the game uh, because they're putting in cars that they don't have licenses for. But at the same time, it's also Roblox because they don't have licenses. So it's kind of both, but... It is what it is. Mostly Roblox because they don't have licenses for these cars, uh, which really sucks. And dude, I, I don't know if Roblox is ever going to get licenses for these cars because Roblox is not really a car-based game, but a lot of their most popular games do have a lot of cars in them. And if Roblox did end up buying a li licenses for all these cars, then a lot of other games could use those car licenses and actually bring more players and stuff like that too, which I think would be uh, really cool. But you know what? I don't have any saying that. I'm not, I don't freaking, I, I'm just, I just freaking make YouTube videos on Roblox. All right. But yeah, boys. I would say if all car brands are leaving Roblox, if, if they just start s s disappearing, getting out of here, we already have a ton that are gone. If more and more start to disappear, I think car brands, are, like, I mean, not car brands, I think games like Greenville and Southwest Florida, they're going to have to start making fictional cars, which Greenville has already done that, but I'm not going to lie, they're kind of stinky. The Greenville fiction cars are kind of stinky, but Southwest Florida has no fictional cars, but I really, I, I have high hopes for Southwest Florida when they do make fictional cars, uh, because if you go in their Discord, uh, in the Stridge of Development, I'll pull it up right here. Pull over here, it says, Kai and Stridget said, We are hiring Stridget Development. It was looking for talented 3 model designers and artists. Please fill out the form linked below if you're, a, I think you are a good fit for the team. And it says, One plus user experience of making cars of their own designs in 3D or 2D software, of their own designs right here. So, sounds like we're going to have some custom cars coming into Southwest Florida, some fictional cars. I have high hopes for that because I feel like Southwest Florida would be the game to make, like, really nice looking fictional cars. Like, Driving Empire, on the other hand, their fictional cars are just, uh... If Southwest Florida was going to make fictional cars, I feel like they'd be fire. So, I have high hopes for them. But, if more car brands start disappearing out of Roblox in Southwest Florida and Greenville, uh, just all car games in general, I feel like they're, they're definitely still going to be around. They're not just going to delete the entire game. Just put everything that they've made and worked hard for to waste. They're not going to do that. Like, that's that'd be stupid of them to do that. They put all this... They make this great game. Um, which, the cars are the main part of the game. Without the cars, it does kind of suck. But they can make some fictional cars and uh, make up for it, and it'd still be pretty fire. I would still play Greenville and Southwest Florida even if they had fictional cars. I mean, like, GTA and BMG Driver are probably one of my favorite games ever, and they have fictional cars, and I still love those games. So, yeah, if car brands, more car brands, start to leave Roblox, then I think we're going to have to go down the route of fictional cars. But we'll have to see, unless Roblox just decides to buy car licenses, which I... That 
would be top tier. We can have every single car in the game. We can do whatever we want to them. And we won't have to worry about them leaving at all. We can actually have the real brands, which would be cool. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I really hope Roblox will buy some freaking car licenses. I, I, I hope so. I really hope so. Forgot to put this in the beginning of the video, but I think this all stemmed from Driving Empire. As you guys know, it all started the snowball effect after Driving Empire came out with that stupid gambling thing, which Roblox, they did not like that. And, uh, I, I, yeah, it, they, it was those chests, I think, that you would buy for Robux and you would roll and you would get cars. And I think that is where that stemmed from because after that, after that, it just started spiraling and car brands just started disappearing. And there's also rumors that people are starting to email uh, car companies for some reason telling them that Roblox is using them without licenses and that's what's getting them out. But I, I really don't know if that's true. I haven't really seen an actual email or any proof that that's actually a thing. And who in the right mind would actually do that? Like, what is the... I really don't see the point... And, and sitting there and emailing car companies, Roblox is using your car without license. Like, what does that benefit you? It, I feel like it doesn't, but, you know, it is what it is. But, uh, yeah, but I thought I'd just make this short little video talking about all the car brands and everything that is going on with Roblox because I've never made a video on it. So, I thought this would be a good time to make a video, just get all the information out together and stuff like that. But, uh, yeah, boys, I it would not be surprised if more car brands start leaving Roblox. This just seems like every week, every day. Uh, there's just more and more car brands leaving, unfortunately, so it just is what it is, but I'm guessing we're going to start seeing some fictional cars come out, so hopefully they're fire, we'll have to see, but uh, yeah, boys, I appreciate every single one of you for watching this video, hope you guys learned something about this video about the uh, cars and stuff leaving Roblox, if you guys were uninformed about that, if you did, make sure to leave a like on the video, but uh, yeah, boys, I'm about bounce, and I'll catch you guys in the next one, see ya!